Headquarters located. Captured the Headquarters located. Captured the objective. Hey guys, what's up? It's Valor Tutorials here, and today I'm bringing you another Adobe After Effects tutorial. And it's going to be on how to do a vignette, which is basically a border on your clip, whatever you want it to be. Um, blurred and black, I'm going to be showing you. So import your file, whatever it is, and uh, come in, drag it in, and then go to whatever, you know, I'm just going to look for a decent part. Go to new, adjustment layer. This is for the blurred one. And then come up and go uh, tools. Take your ellipse tool or elliptical, whatever. And make it decently big. And um, yeah. And then you kind of like uh, center it. What the fuck? Center it a bit middle of the screen ish I don't think that looks too metal center it with the arrows or whatever you want it looks pretty decent come in here make sure you come down to the mask right here and click inverted and then come down on the mask click for mask feather right there click about 250 or 300 around there it just looks a lot better and it's not as like cut sharp and you can use any blur you want I mean, they all look decent, even if it's like a spin blur or something like that. But your best bet is a uh, Gaussian blur or Gaussian, whatever you want to call it. And so just coming in, it's a really easy, quick one. Just drag it up to about four or five. And um, if you can't tell, it's blurred. Yeah, that's how you do the blurred one. All right, now we're going to take that off. I'm actually going to copy the mask because I like that mask. Um, copy it. We're gonna come delete that. Um, solid. And then, base. Yeah. Just about the same thing. Except when you do the mask for the black one, uh, you basically do all the same steps, except you make a black solid and then feather it like that. Instead of an adjustment layer with the blur. And on this one, you might want to make this, uh, elliptical tool or whatever might make it like you know somewhat like that that looks good doesn't it nice blackish and you could turn on the um, opacity opacity whatever turn it down a bit and give it a better look and yeah that's it if you enjoyed this tutorial helped you out anything like that if you learned something um, subscribe if you already haven't, and like and favorite the video to help us get more publicity. Thanks.